Happy Saturday, everybody. You know what Saturday means? Saturday means fresh produce. Yes, it does. So I wanted to give you um, an idea of why I look forward to Saturdays so much now. Once this pandemic hit, it became a challenge. Like, where are you gonna find your fresh produce, right? Because you can't go to the farmer's market and even to go to the grocery store, you'd have to stand in line outside, right? And only let so many people in at a time. And it just got a little bit challenging just to get basics. Um, so anyways, one of my friends was getting these deliveries on Saturdays and I asked her about it. She sent me the link. It was Barn to Door. Um, it's a farm called Yasakuchi Farms. I, I know I'm butchering the name, but something like that, Yasakuchi Farms. And they're located in the northern part of San Diego County, like Oceanside area. Um, and they have 15 employees. And when the pandemic hit, they were worried how they were gonna sustain themselves, how they were gonna continue to sell their produce. Because again, they couldn't go, there was no farmer's markets to sell. And so they came up with an, they started delivering barn to door deliveries through the county, which I thought was great. And I wanna support a small business like that. So it doesn't require a monthly subscription. You can go log on and decide you wanna get a box that week and not the next week. You can change it up. The small box is $25, the large is 35. And you don't get to pick what's in it, but I think that's the best part. It kind of gives you a preview and an email what might come in the box or an idea of what's gonna be in it. But I like the variety because when I walk into Sprouts or I walk into the grocery store, like if you're like me, you sort of have your staples. I always buy bell peppers, I always buy mushrooms, I always, I would always buy purple onion for instance. I never bought white onion and a white onion came in one of these boxes and I'm like, oh, why did I never buy white onion? This is great. So just reasons like that I think are really cool. And then if you get something that you're not a big fan of or there's just an abundance, you have too much, you share with your neighbors, they love it. Family, friends, like everyone is, you know, gets a treat. So $35, here's what you get, all right? I'm gonna show you now. Let's see if I can flip this. Is it flipping? So here is the fresh barn to door delivery from Yasakuchi Farms. Look at all these goodies. $35, this is the large box. You got some nice um, green onions here, fresh mushrooms, a nice watermelon, my favorite. Um, I have some fresh cucumbers down here. Um, some avocado, ooh, some onions over there, some bell peppers, pomegranates. Um, look at this fresh spring mix here. Asparagus, mmm, yum. Some carrots, uh, fresh garlic. I think I saw some bok choy at the bottom. Blackberries, lemon, sweet potatoes, uh, some grapes in there. Just look at all these goodies in here, right? I mean, there is just no shortage of fresh product here. For $35, again, I like that they don't let you pick what's in it. You do get a preview of what might be in the box. Oh, just beautiful, just beautiful. Look at these broccoli. Oh, I am so excited to make some good food with all this. Um, Again, when you go to the grocery store, that's Milo's pa there. When you go to the grocery store, you know, you grab the same things, right? Kind of tend to gravitate towards our staple items. And this gets me to stretch myself a little bit and use uh, fruits or vegetables that I don't typically grab at the store. So again, just thought I'd share with you my little review of Yasakuchi Farms, barn to door, uh, delivery every week or, or not, you know, you don't have does not require a monthly subscription or a weekly subscription. You just get it when you want it. And you can do, again, the $35 box, which is this one, the large one, or you can get a smaller one for $25. All right, everybody, happy Saturday. Eat healthy. Have a wonderful weekend.